Now, if you're into true crime, you almost certainly have heard the name Robert Maudsley. He is a man who is now 70 years old and he went to prison at the age of 21 for killing one person and whilst in detention, including in psychiatric hospitals and prison, where he's been since then, he's killed a further three people. He's recently in the news because he's just broken the record of the longest time that somebody spent in solitary confinement because he's that dangerous. He has spent a whopping 16,500 consecutive days in solitary confinement. What I think is quite unique about Robert Maudsley is his choice of victims. So the first person that he killed whilst in the community was a child predator. At least one of the other three people that he killed inside prison was also a child predator. At least another was a wife killer. So I don't think this is a coincidence. I think there's a, he's got a method to choosing his victims and it's all to do with like his own moral hierarchy. I've gone into a lot more detail in my full video on my channel, The Site for Sore Minds, so go chiggity check it out. The link will be in the description. But just to summarize, he's not allowed to leave his cell probably till the day that he dies. He turns 70 in uh, solitary confinement, in isolation, and he's almost certainly never gonna be let out because he is such a dangerous man. 